Betwabu, Betwabu. Today I am on day 21, so I have another 10 days to go. I think I'm going to do 31 because October has 31 days. Why not take advantage of that extra day? Maybe I'll do some sort of wrap up video. But today I am talking about something based on what happened to me um, yesterday. I had said that um, the house was going to have people in it and I had to do my video early although I didn't push it out until late but based on something that happened yesterday I am speaking today yeah the motorcycle riders the people with the loud mufflers only come out now <laughs> anyhow Someone said to me that they were going to take advantage of this upcoming season. It's the quote unquote Christmas, Christmas magic nonsense. <laughs> I'm just going to throw this out there. They say things like you have to get into the Christmas spirit. I don't feel like I'm in the Easter spirit. This tells you that there's something surrounding those particular seasons. A spirit. All right. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I'm not getting into too many deep, deep teachings right now. In the future I will, but right now, no. So this person said that they were going to sit down over the next while and in the evenings just watch one quote-unquote Hallmark movie after another I'm outside my fingers were starting to get cool so I said you're just gonna just binge watch binge watch Hallmark movies they're melanated and I said oh, okay and she's like that brings me joy and I was like all right I'd like to know what brings you joy <laughs> was, <laughs> was snapped back at me uh, so of course I don't divulge things like that to people who vibrate at a low level so <laughs> that was food for thought for me and I was just like I'm gonna need to talk about that so what brings me joy is putting out things for my people to wake up putting out things for my people to be encouraged putting out books and uh, podcasts and videos and my poetry and all the different things that I'm doing right now so that my people wake up and my people are encouraged on that note I'm going to say that my podcast was finally made live today yes it was supposed to be on the 15th but that didn't happen so it's finally live at the Sambuca Speaks podcast and I have not uploaded anything onto YouTube yet. I am thinking I'm going to, but I will hold off on it for a little while because in order for me to put it onto YouTube, I have to do some more editing. And the whole idea for doing the podcast was so that I didn't have to edit videos. And here I am doing a 30 day challenge. So for me, putting out things, for people to have joy brings me joy for encouraging to encourage people that brings me joy to make people think that brings me joy but to consume yeah I do that occasionally but the only consumption I do as a rule is consumption to enlighten myself now I have been caught scrolling every now and again and watching a stupid video or two 
As a matter of fact, I do voiceovers for that sort of thing, but it's to bring in an income. It's not just for voiceover for nothing's sake. It's to bring in an income. So I remember reading a book a while back and it was saying basically that consumers remain consumers but producers make things for consumers and I'm choosing to be a producer at this moment I am in the mental state of being a millionaire but I'm telling you that eventually I will be one because I am choosing to produce more than I consume and what I put into my mind is also that which will make me into what I'm putting into my mind. So I am not just putting in fluff and foolishness into my mind, I am putting in things that will encourage my mind, things that are changing my programming that I've had from when I was a child. So to answer that question, bringing me joy, things that bring me joy are encouraging my people, waking my people up, giving my people information and things that I've created that can en enhance their lives. Making people one step better, helping them be one step better than they were when they started watching my videos or listening to my podcast or reading my book, that is what I want to do. At the end of a Hallmark movie, one movie, I can't say that I would be that much farther ahead. I've talked about this on another video. I can't remember which one. I will try and remember and link it in at the end note or in the description box. But I talked about people just sitting in front of the TV and watching stupidness. I am not aiming to be one of those people. I am aiming to be one of the people who when you look on my website, which is coming, you will see that I have been working hard at creating things that will help improve the lives of my people. So that's what brings me joy. And singing. I, I didn't put any singing stuff in there. But all the things I do are encouragement as a rule. I don't like being in a negative space. So, this is Sambuca. Until next time, remember to sprinkle your flavor wherever you go and make it a sweet one. And I would love to know what brings you joy as well. I really would love to know. Comment in the, in, uh, the comment section and let me know what you do to bring you joy. Nature brings me joy. Hearing the birds sing brings me joy watching a stream or a river, being near water, a waterfall, those all also bring me joy. <laughs> watching a Hallmark movie, not so much. Until next time, bye-bye.